Did you know that you can customize the appearance of the app drawer on your Samsung Galaxy phone and make it more minimalist? In this tutorial, we will explore an interesting option that allows you to hide the app labels beneath their icons. If you want a cleaner and more modern look, follow the steps below. So first, open your Galaxy Store. Then, find the Good Lock app and install it if you don't have it yet. After the installation is complete, tap the Open button to directly open the Good Lock app. Once you're in the Good Lock app, go to the Makeup section, scroll down, and find the module called Home Up. Once you find it, tap the Download icon on the right. Wait a few moments for the module to download and install. After you finish installing the Home Up module, return to the top, and you will see the Home Up module you installed. If you want to add it to the home screen, tap More, and in the menu that appears, select Add to Home Screen. Now tap on Home Up. Then on this page, tap the Start button, and in the pop-up window, choose the Allow All option. Once you've done that, enable the Home Up module by tapping the switch. Immediately after that, you'll see several options. Select the Home Screen option. On the Home Screen Settings page, you will see several options. Scroll down a bit, and at the bottom of the screen, you will see an option called App Icon Setting. Tap it to open. In this section, you will see an option to increase or decrease the icon size, hide app labels on the home screen, and of course, the option we need, which is to hide app labels from the app drawer. So, tap the switch next to the Show App Icon Label on Apps option to hide the app labels from the app drawer. And that's it. Now, return to the app screen, and you will see that the app labels are gone, leaving only the icons. You have now achieved a minimalist look for your app drawer on your Samsung Galaxy phone. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, please leave a like, share the video with your friends, and subscribe to my channel for more tutorials like this. Thank you so much for watching, and of course, I'll see you very soon in my new video.